Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new save file. We are jumping in again and let's see who we're going to go. I did Lilith last time. Um, we've uh, there's still a lot of vanilla characters that we've got to we've got to get quite a lot of marks as we've got we've got a lot going on here. Um, Tainted Jacob to mother could be interesting. Let's give that a go. I do enjoy Tainted Jacob on occasion. He is a bit of a spicy boy. Um, and I don't know. I like a challenge sometimes. I like a challenge. I am not opposed to a little bit of difficulty in my run. Um, it, it depends, really. It depends. Sometimes it can be a bit much, but I don't know. Tainted Jacob's the... I, I think he's, like, the right level of challenge for a challenge character. Like, clearly he is designed to be painful, obviously. But I think I think that he's, like, the right level of that. Do you know that? Well, that was kind of fucking rude. Oh, this is very rude. You need to chill out, my guy. There you go. Dippy fresh over here, trying to uh, trying to interrupt interrupt our style, interrupt what we got going on here. Oh, this is that was the most stupid. <laughs> I just I just kind of stood there. I just kind of stood there. Oh, he ate up their shots as well. Interestingly enough. Anyways, we are we are ghost form right now, which is uh, not ideal for this early on, but we shall accept our fate and push through. As for the question of the day today, what's a country's cuisine that you think is very underrated? What's like, do you know how everyone's like, oh, I love Italian food, I love Chinese food. What's like a cuisine that you think does not get the representation it deserves? Because I bet there's a few out there that I don't even know about that are really, really good, that, that people just don't talk about enough. That was not a great hit there. This guy could super super easily kill me. <laughs> Look at this, he's speeding along. Okay, my guy. Let's chill out, let's let's relax, let's take it easy. Hey, there you go. Ooh, that's actually not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, I'm hoping I can still make it through this floor fine, regardless of my, uh, of my errors that I have made. Good, good. By doing stuff like that is, is how I'm thinking I'll achieve that. We'll hope for the best. But yeah, but there's some country's cuisines that I'm like not that, that aren't on my radar that I should be really, really looking out for. And of course, I I mean I unlocked Broken Murder and a new pill apparently, so <laughs> that's nice. <laughs> I don't really know why, but I think I downloaded a mod that removes the need for dailies. I think it was something to do with that, because dailies are just I don't want to do dailies. <laughs> I have to uninstall all my mods to do dailies. It's not fun. I don't want to have to do that. I want to just play the game the way I want to play the game. And you're going to let me do that, aren't you? But yeah, I bet there's some some restaurants and stuff that like... Oh, God damn it. Uh, that I've like never never considered going to that I really should con consider going to. Um, and I'd, I'd love to hear from you guys about what some of those might be. Whether that be some, some of like potentially your own cuisine, your own country's cuisine, or just something that you know about that is really good. Because, yeah, I bet there's just so many out there. My, my favourite is, is probably still um, Greek food. Greek and Italian are, like, are like top tier. Um, I'm starting... I, I've, been, I've been enjoying... Um, I've been enjoying, like, Japanese food a lot more recently as well. Um, but, yeah, Greek food... Greek food's interesting, because the variety in Greek food is relatively low. It's not, like, exactly super, super low, but compared to some other some other countries' cuisines, th th there isn't a ton of variety there, um, compared to some of the other countries, but it is just, like, they, they, they basically picked, like, 20 or so items and absolutely, well and truly perfected them. And that's why I'm going back to Greece for another holiday in October. Ooh, Ludo. Oh, this is going to be... This is going to be hellish. <laughs> Especially considering I'm already on low HP. If I can get my shot speed up, it might not be so bad. But right now, this is not going to be easy. Being able, Having to basically babysit my own shots as well as this guy. It's going to be It's gonna be a rather interesting setup. I mean, I'm, I'm already not very happy with my health. I mean, I've been hit quite a few times this floor, but... The boss shall give us a HP up and alleviate all of my woes. Yeah. What are you doing, good sir? 
you. I can't I can't actually chase him quick enough. There you go. That's not a HP up, but it's close. We didn't unfortunately didn't get a key yet, so Mother is not in the cards for us right now. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll we will have to restart if we don't get a key for Mother this floor. Because uh, I really do want to do Mother as our boss. And I will make sure that happens. But yeah, Luda, if we can get some shot speeds up, he's actually pretty goddamn good. I really like Luda. But low shot speed Luda is uh, is pretty brutal. Especially when we're dealing with the uh, the regular big bad. We have recently, um, me and my girlfriend, we went to a, um, we went to a spa day that my mum bought us. Um, she actually bought us another day for Christmas, which is awesome because it was just one of the best days ever. Um, we, we went for a, a Mexican for, for lunch before we arrived at the spa, and then after we went for a Greek um, at this place we hadn't tried before that we'd been sort of had on our list for a little while and just never really got around to actually trying. And oh my god, like, it's... I've been to Greece. Obviously, I know the food there is amazing. And this place was on par, if not better, than some of the food we had in Greece, which is... I mean, it was it was run by Greek people, so it kind of makes sense, but it was just... Oh, it was incredible. Absolutely fantastic. I love that when you go to a restaurant and you're excited about going because it's something new and it's actually good. I mean, so often you go somewhere and it's just... It doesn't live up to what you built it up to be or doesn't live up to the hype that other people maybe built it up to be. Um, And this this was, oh, just insanely good. Uh, what's going on here? Why are all these guys, uh, why are all these guys all purpley and strange? We got one bomb out of that, really. Okay, we got plenty of keys this time, which is good. Black lung is fine, I guess. I got the black lung, pop. Right, um, quickly bomb this. Lovely. We've still got two keys remaining, one for the shop and one for Mother. Right. Ow. Bad hit. Ooh, golden bombs as well, you say. Golden bombs as well, you say. We'll try and take a little cheeky peek at secret room here, which I believe to be right here. There you go. Some extra copper bombs, why not? And we got double world, which doesn't really do much for us, I guess, at this point. Anyways, let's keep it moving. Probably should have just saved a world card for the next floor. I mean, a hanged man might be useful. Yeah, okay, so some something's going on. All the enemies are, um, are like, poisoned, or these spiders at least are, are poisoned. But I don't have an item that does that, from what I can see. So I'm a bit confused, I'll be honest, I'm a bit confused. Okay, I, I could I could buy the placebo pill just in case. I guess I will. Just in case it, we get something good going on from that. Don't know if we will, but it's worth a, a try. So it's not all like it's not all enemies, maybe it's just those spiders. I don't I don't, I don't really know why. Taking some bad damage, but we've gained a lot of health this floor, so that's not particularly terrible. Really, you moved out of the way my bomb straight away. That's just kind of rude. Okay, you need, need to stop moving, my guy, so that I can bomb you. God damn it, stop moving so I can bomb you. There you go. Sty, lovely. Some extra bombs, very nice. And we'll get heading down to the mother floor. The downpour mother floor, and see how this goes. I'm hoping we get something for placebo pretty quick, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna bet on it. Annoyingly, Luda automatically. Oh, that's sick. Luda, Luda automatically moves these guys when you hit them, which isn't how I expected it to work, to be honest. And it's quite annoying. Mr. Piss Bucket over here. Take him out. I mean, rooms like this are just genuinely quite difficult for uh, for us with Luda. I mean, you can see as well our tier rate is pretty abysmal right now. Like, the, the ticks of damage are pretty slow. I mean, the fact that this guy spawned in on this room is kind of... Oh, really? All of that's creep? It's still there? I didn't realize it had persisted so long. See what I mean? These guys are so hard to hit because they just bounce around. That creep lasted so long. So we, we, we took a, a, a number of hits there we probably shouldn't have. 
Yeah, we're getting a lot of a lot of enemies with this curse of um, fragility. Is it? I don't I don't particularly know what's going on with that. Um, maybe it's something to do with a black lung. I genuinely don't know. Uh, wait, is, is there a bomb that dropped in here? Yes, there is. Hello, hello, Mr. Bomb. Oh, but yeah, I could, I could really go for a good Greek meal. When, when I was at this place, I got... Uh, I, basically, when, whenever I go to new places, I, I, I tend to like to try new things as much as I can. Whoa, what the hell? I tend to like to try new things as much as I possibly can. I'm, 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 I will order, obviously, the things that I know I like often, but I also do try to have a good smat uh, spattering of, uh, of, of new things as well. Um, as long as it's in the vein of being something that I'm going to like sort of thing. I'm not going to try something that clearly isn't for me. Um, but in, in the sort of thingy of um, going to this new place, I was like, okay, I'm going to have to try something new here. God, this shot speed in a large room. Stop with the large rooms, please. Um, I decided I'm going to try something new. So I got, I think it was called Rosso or something like that. Basically, it was like, um, I think it was Lamb Shoulder in like a tomato and garlic sauce and oh my lord it was like the best lamb i've ever eaten in my life it was so very good nice i don't really know why i went in here to be honest uh there is a pill in here though um i think we'll buy that and we'll buy the pill as well and see if we get anything of value from this hey it's a look up a six room charge for a lockup. Um, there's some more pills as well there. I think I'll probably take Dark Bomb, you know. Right, I'm just going to use these pills to find out what they are. And if you come across them again, I mean, that's a health down, so. We'll take the lockup, thank you. Six room charge for a lockup is not bad. Okay, boss time. Got to remember to go back and get our uh, thingy piece. Ooh, we got Red Colostomia, which I don't remember how this guy works. Okay, he's he's not that bad. He's not that bad. Probably going to get hit by this. Yep. Did not mean to do that, obviously, you fucking stupid game. <sighs> I hate the fact that the fucking pill and stuff are on the same goddamn button. It's the worst design ever. Change it, now. My forgetful little brain can't do it. Wasted my goddamn pill. Uh, that's really, really frustrating, because now we don't have more lookups. We could have had lookups coming out the wazoo there. Right, anyways, we will uh, double bomb this. And we will go and quickly grab our thingy. Yeah, no devil deal there, apparently, which is strange. Did I get a devil deal last floor? I think I might have done and just passed it up. It's a bit stupid of me. Boom, 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 boom. Right. Have to go through this goddamn room again. Some of these rooms are going to be very, very rough. Oh, now that was pretty. I just weaved through the middle there and hoped I could get as much damage as possible in and it worked out pretty damn well. Oh, hello. Oh, that guy can hit you over the top of rocks. I did not realize that was the case. Okay. Honestly, probably not a bad thing that that run has perished, considering the Luda of it all was a bit, uh, a bit spicy. I'm gonna have to quickly open up something here one second. No worries. Right. Yeah, considering the Luda of it all, I mean, we got a planetarium this far. I mean, you know what's gonna happen though, don't you? No, no key incoming. Don't know what this does. I'll just use it in a in a room and see. Okay. It's just some bones. It's just some bones. Alright, boy will be spawning any second now. Probably in this room. There you go. Hello, my friend. How are you today? 
Quince is pretty good. I will take Quince. I would like some bombs and a key, please. Because we have Tinted Rocks galore and a Planetarium, which I very much would like to open. Okay, Quince is, is great as well here. Hey, there's a key at least. Planetarium, Planetarium. What might you hold? If you are Mars, I will actually strangle a child. I will find one. That's not bad. That's not bad. Serious. That is not bad. Venus for the HP plus the uh, charm, which essentially means no more contact damage from enemies. Pretty good. I like that. I like that quite a bit. Right. Keep going. It's definitely not one of the best we could have got, but I think overall, pretty good haul. Don't know why the spikes here aren't up. Yeah, I like these guys look just easy peasy. We got a bomb out of that as well, so we can go back for our tinted rocks. Ooh, two seraphims there was, was pretty awesome. That overall was very good. Right, quickly go back and get one of our tinted rocks here. I'm hoping for a uh, small rock, but you can't always get what you want. Where the hell was this tinted rock? Am I thinking of the last floor? Oh, there it is. Okay, two soul hearts is definitely a good consolation prize. That's the second best thing I could have hoped for. Right, we don't have an extra key for Mother yet, but that's fine. Down to the next floor for now. Probably should have took that trinket, but it is what it is. This time I should probably go Devil Deal, considering I can take at least one of them for free. I kind of forget that with this character often. Yeah. Venus to just have... Uh, there's an extra key. Uh, Venus to just have enemies fighting against each other rather than against us is very nice. Oh, I didn't... You, were, you weren't quite in my Venus radius. Double bomb there. Pretty lovely. Yeah, realistically, we want to try and, like, sort of walk up as close as we can get to enemies without touching them, so that we can um, have some infighting start. I mean, that was quite nice. That, there's our second key as well, lovely. Only one soul heart from this one, but that's not that big of a problem. Oh, Lord. There is a lot of boys. Ah, you bastard. It's okay. We've got an extra key. Um, What's in here? Bell of Circles. Best friend is obviously not very good, but it, it does it does a pretty hefty amount of damage to bosses, so that part of it I can't hit. That part of it I cannot hit. Right. It also does attract enemies near to it, which is kind of nice too, but that's, I feel that's more of like an, I won't say niche ability of it, but I don't really get to u utilize that that much. Oh, we got a platinum poo. The rarest of poops. Good old platinum poo, baby. Was not expecting that. Right, uh, confessional, I think we just go for a soul heart for now. Okay, okay, okay. Right, in here we go. Pop that down. Oh, that was close. Good, good. Grab this. Go in here first to see if there's anything we want to buy. Okay. Yeah, we'll we'll buy uh, Johnny's knives. And then we'll take a hit and take this for free. And then we'll come down here. Johnny's knives is just fantastic. Really, really good quality for item. Pretty worthwhile at the quality for title, I'd say. Basically, as we're shooting things, these knives are going to be dip diving and dodging around the room, slicing enemies up, doing good damage, uh, giving us a fire rate bonus. Apparently, I don't really know why why we're getting fire rate bonuses, but apparently that's something to do with Johnny's knives. Maybe is it? Let's have a look. Um, one sec. No, it doesn't. It doesn't get tell us because our last item was uh was not Johnny's knives. I'm stupid. But yeah, also the fact that they're herming is just like another amazing addition to it. On top of everything else. Uh, we might as well do this. Oh, we have flight. I'm so stupid. Absolute waste of a bomb there. Kind of forgot we had flight for a hot minute. 
But yeah, the, 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 the charm plus all of this is actually... We're in a good spot here. This is a pretty interesting run. But yeah, I think some food that I want to try next that I think I might have had in the past, but I don't remember, is uh, Lebanese. You see a lot of Lebanese places, and apparently they do some, some pretty amazing food. So I'd like to give that a go. Ow. Pretty bad hit there, but... Let's not dwell. Ooh, yes please. I imagine getting multiple Johnny's knives. I don't know if they will actually stack, but that would be kind of amazing if they did. Um, I mean, there you go. So we get um, this again, which I will take for the extra tiers up. It's not a lot of tiers, mind you, but it's extra HP as well, so... I do not dislike. And into the shop as well. Shop's going to be good for us. I mean, divorce papers. I don't actually know what the other thing was. Okay, take Keeper's Sack first, obviously. Take divorce papers. Thank you. Do we have a red heart about? We do not. Okay, that didn't that didn't really work the way I was hoping it would. Oh nope, it did. Holy shit. <laughs> Amazing. What the fuck? Right, uh, quickly check in here. Okay. Again, not really what I'm looking for here, but. Oh, we got a lump of coal out of it though, that's not bad. Okie dokie. Right, double bomb through here. Make sure to go and get our key piece in a second. Man, that was pretty awesome. Resonance disc already paying out in a pretty nice way. Luckily, we don't have to go far to um, get to our mirror here. I right, gotta be very careful here. I don't actually know how this guy's damage affects me if I get hit while in ghost form. I'm really not sure, but yeah, we've got a pretty a pretty strong setup here. I can't I honestly can't remember where I'm going now that I don't have my map, so probably gonna go to some rooms I don't need to go to here. But, as you can clearly see, some rewards to be yielded from going to extra rooms, certainly. Extra bombs, extra consumables is all good. Honestly, more money we can get the better now we've got Keeper's Sack as well. Everyone knows Keeper's Sack is pretty busted. Double hearts, I don't think I need that. I kind of want to do the boss, but it's so risky. I might give it a go. I might give it a go. It's so risky, but... This run just seems like the one. If there's going to be a run to do it, it should be this run. Didn't quite get the same look as last time. Tails popping up now. Blue cap, very nice. Even more fire rate. Okay, that worked out pretty swimmingly. Really? Four coins? Is that it? Back through the mirror we go. Pretty happy thus far. I'm even going to bomb my mirror on the way out as well, so that I can get the extra reflected item chances, I think. I think it's worthwhile. Right, again, grab our money where we can grab it. Pretty sure there's another Fool's Gold Rocks uh, cluster in here. That there is. That's more like it, baby. That's more like it. Right. To the next floor. Feeling pretty good about how things are going thus far. Got good old Johnny's knives ready and waiting. Ready to pounce. Don't know why my knife's not there. You go. Johnny's knives just weren't going anywhere then. Friendly Psy Hunter, why not? 
Oh, he he does some he does some damage, baby. There's quite a, quite a lot of things we have that actually would be pretty nice to have duplicates of. I'm really hoping that, that the knives can be duplicated, but I'm having a feeling they can't, so I'm not going to hold out hope for that. Thank you, Psy Hunter. You are doing God's work. Oh man, this is such a fun build we've got going on right now. Honestly, the knives might be one of my favourite items from the uh, Warp Zone pack. Really, really cool. It's kind of rare that you get a, a quality 4 item that's actually unique and fun and not just, like, overpowered. I mean, these are pretty goddamn strong, but... Ah, oh, really? We're at fire it. <coughs> My bad. <coughs> oh, one sec. I think I'm better? Okay. Uh, but unfortunately, we've reached fire it, Cap, so... Oh, what the hell? Didn't mean to touch the spikes. Yeah, a little bit annoying to take divorce papers there when it wasn't necessary at all, but such is life. We've got a Yara here. I guess we take Yara, but I'm going to use this first. Why not use this first? And then, yeah, bring Gera along. I don't really know what for as of yet. I've not got a, a solid plan in mind, but having it is better than not. Ma Do you know, I'm, I'm starting to think that maybe Johnny's Knives is benefiting from Lump of Coal, because it seems to be doing more damage than it previously was. I don't know if that's just me, but it would make sense that if Lump of Coal is affecting it, it's doing a lot more damage because it's travelling more. Right, buy whatever's in here, regardless of what it is. I mean, coin flip is pretty good, to be fair. Maybe I want to keep coin flip. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep coin flip. Okay, unfortunately, we have come across the fuck. I'm so confused at what's happened here. I, I thought I got hit by my Ghosty Boy, but apparently not. I got hit a lot, but I'm unsure as to what actually happened there. I mean, it's it's all over now. Unfortunately, we just got another fucking replacement, but it was from Marrow this time, which isn't ideal. But a lot of Burn Hearts is nice. Right, I think we're good to go here. Um, yes, we are. Oh, God, that was weird. That was a bit spicy. That boss went very skewiff. A bit cattywampus. Right. Yeah, I'm liking the amount of burn hearts we got right now. That's, that's useful. Yeah, it must be benefiting from Lump of Coal. It, they seem to be doing insane damage right now, which we, of course, like quite a bit. Oh, God. Go, my knifey boys. Yeah, it seems like a lot of bomb-based items have been, uh... Bomb-based enemies have been, like, weakened, but... So, actually, do you know what I think's happening? Do you know that last run, I got that red bomb item as my first item that weakens all bomb-based enemies? I think it's persisting through to this run for some reason. I don't know why, but I think that's that, that item is persisting through to another run. Roll of film. I would very much like to get um, Mum's keys. Mum's key is very good. <gasps> oh my lord. Very, very nice. I like that quite a bit. Goes quite nicely with that active, actually. Right. Item room we're at, though. Do the boss first, why not? Why is it always Gideon? It's always goddamn Gideon. Lost one of my burn hearts. Mostly fine. Which 
careful of the fires that draw. That was close. Kind of didn't really bother to get out of the way of that then. It just luckily missed me. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I love the uh, the damage sound of the, uh, the, the, the Johnny's knives as well. Makes it sound so powerful. Are we seriously only going to get one coin from this entire endeavor? Dude! <laughs> Stop! Unfortunately, Residence Disc is uh, is replacing a lot of our items with um, items we already have, which is the point. But unfortunately, not the items we already have that we want. So maybe we ought to drop Residence Disc at this point, because I feel like it's just going to keep giving us tears ups. And we don't really want any more tears ups. I feel like we're, 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 we're tapped out on tears. In here we've got... Money equals powers. Very nice what we currently have set up. Oh, come on. There you go. Not an item I was really looking for, to be honest, but thanks. Right. Kind of an interesting active. Each cost one coin, hitting a wall, bullets have a chance to fade. Killing enemy with the crowd funder may also drop extra money. Kind of an interesting idea. I'm going to take this. Oh ho ho ho, that is a haul and a half, lovely. Okay, that was pretty good, that was pretty good. We could have even Yerrod those, to be fair. If I'd have opened that chest first, I'd have Yerrod all the hearts and then also Yerrod the, uh, the little spiky chest, but oh well. Right, we, we leave, we go. Waste of a burn heart there, but it's fine. Right. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to actually use Crowdfunder that much, but I basically I'm thinking maybe we use it on the boss, but we'll see. It's just an interesting, interesting item to have. Infested, you sir. How about no? But this one's definitely going better than the first. We are making some progress. Wish my coins would drop a little more regularly, but we can't get everything. We do have flight, that makes that a little bit easier. Ah, oh, grab my double bombs there. Hello, friend. You're back. Of course, you're back. Right, we'd like to use the shop here as well to buy some good stuff. We'll check what's going on in here. Unfortunately, not much. A soul heart, though, is pretty nice. Thank you. Yeah, it's kind of weird because it's like we we gain we gain damage from having money, but spending money pr can gain us damage. I think it's better to spend the money now and then just hope we increase our money via our coin tiers later on. Right there you go. Hey, look, Penny's kind of nice. Also, all this extra money is lovely too. Okay, very nice. Some brimstone -y boys here. Don't know how that other guy died. Vakana must have got him. Beautiful. Money is in a very good spot right now for extra damage, but also for purchasing power on this floor and the next. Try and kill the brimstone -y boys first. I'm liking the concussive tiers as well. A little bit of extra damage, which we kind of needed. Um, but the concussion tiers itself, actually getting the concussion off is kind of nice. Uh, we've not seen our item room yet, but let's go straight for our boss. It is Hornfell. Um, I, I love this boss, and the champion versions are pretty fun. Ooh. I have been smushed. I actually visually got smushed. Okay. 
bad, unfortunately. Oh, no! No! I was... I got smushed by that guy, and I thought that was it. I thought he was done. I, I didn't know he could do it again. Oh, that's such a bad way to lose that run. Oh, that's a shame. Either way, I hope you guys did enjoy this one, and I'll see you guys in the next one.